Hello guys, it's Mr. Apatouch31, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to set up the Apple Wireless Magic Trackpad with Multi-Touch for your Mac. You can, this will work with any Mac, and um, it's a really nice device. It's really big, much bigger than the trackpad on the MacBook Pro, so I enjoy it. It's nice for not if, you, if you're just surfing YouTube or something like that, you don't have to do a lot of clicking. This is great for it. If you have to do a lot of clicking, I recommend either using the MacBook Pro trackpad, it's not as good, or the Magic Mouse is great when you have to do a lot of clicking. But this video was requested, so I will be showing you guys how to do it. That's why I'm not screen recording. What you're going to want to do is find System Preferences. Mine's right here in my dock. You're just going to open that up. Let me just turn this off real quick. Hopefully. Yes, okay, so trackpad off. And then what you're going to want to do is after you open up System Preferences, trackpad you're going to want to find that so just go ahead and click on that okay after you click on trackpad you're going to want to hit over down here set up bluetooth trackpad as you can see it says no trackpad found what you're going to want to do is simply go to the side you can see that power logo right there you want to click that a green light should come on now it's going to search for the magic trackpad so we'll go ahead and let it search it should find it here pretty soon so it just found it and now it's connected it's that easy um, you might have to click continue one more time for some reason it didn't make me I'm not sure when you first connect you'll have a whole bunch of options just move your mouse over one of them there'll be a video in the right corner as you guys can see and you'll be able to see how to do it so you can you know tap to click dragging is really easy dragon's kinda cool I don't have that on though because I don't use it very much you got in secondary click, you just got all these features and it's great that they have a video just in case you don't know how to use the magic trackpad. Um, you can also adjust your tracking speed up here and you can also adjust your double click speed and you can also adjust your scrolling speed. Move it to the right if you want to go faster, move it to the left if you want it to go slower. That's pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did like this video, be sure to thumbs up. If you really like this video, be sure to subscribe for more reviews, giveaways, and tutorials and stuff like this. If you have any videos idea, be sure to leave me a comment below. Again, this video was requested, so I do do mostly requested videos. If you guys ask, I will pretty much do them no matter what, unless it's something dumb. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. One more quick little thing is it does say the trackpad battery level right here. I believe this trackpad takes two AA batteries. I'm not sure. I think it's two, maybe one. I'm not sure. Thank you guys for watching. Please, please, please thumbs up. It really helps me out. And subscribing will help me out even more than thumbsing up. Thank you guys for watching again. I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching.